CompTIA ITF Plus, FC0-U61, Practice Exam. Questions 121 through 125. This video is part of our practice exam video series, and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 121. Following a significant security breach at a major online retailer, users are worried about the potential impact on their accounts on various other platforms. Which of the following is the most likely reason users are concerned about other accounts? The answer is B. Password reuse. The concern over other accounts stems from the common practice of password reuse. Many individuals use the same password across multiple platforms. With password reuse, if one account is compromised, especially from a major retailer known to hold a lot of personal data, cybercriminals can potentially access other platforms using the same credentials. This practice of reusing passwords amplifies the risks of a single breach, potentially giving attackers a way to quickly compromise multiple accounts. Question 122. What device serves both input and output functions? The answer is C. Touchscreen monitor. A touchscreen monitor incorporates both input and output capabilities. It displays information, output, and responds to user interactions via touch input, allowing for a two-way exchange of information with the user. Question 123. What is the rationale behind mandating the use of complex passwords? The answer is B. To prevent an attacker from correctly guessing the password. The primary reason for requiring complex passwords is to create a barrier against attackers successfully guessing them. Complex passwords, which include a mix of letters, numbers, and symbols, increase the number of possible combinations, making the passwords much more difficult to predict and thereby improving the security of user accounts. Question 124. Which of the following best describes a use for the binary notational system? The answer is A to represent two distinct states, often as on or off. The binary system is foundational in computing because it simplifies the way devices process data. Computers use electrical signals, which can be easily translated into a binary system's two states, allowing for straightforward data processing and storage. This system's on or off states correspond to the presence or absence of an electrical charge, respectively, forming the basis of virtually all modern digital technology. Question 125. Which of the following contains exactly for copper wires? The answer is D. USB. A standard USB cable is designed with four individual wires inside. This configuration includes two wires dedicated to power delivery, ensuring the device receives the necessary electrical charge, and two separate wires dedicated for data transfer, allowing for the communication of data between devices. Now, did you stumble on any of these questions? If you did, no worries, it happens. Just remember, our free CompTIA ITF Plus training course is your secret weapon to mastering these topics. Access it through our YouTube channel, anytime you feel the desire to learn more. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.